there and welcome to today's video. I wanted to give you a first look at the new Hobby Miner sluice box. It's kind of been my winter project this year. You know I can't leave well enough alone. So I redesigned it and put an aluminum sluice box on the inside and attached the three d printed parts to it. Um, I'll grab the camera and I'll show you around. So this is the hobby miner. You can see that uh, we have the aluminum sluice box on the inside, same as before, the double power head, same as before, and uh, like I forgot to tell you, we're at the Hellgate Mineral Society Rock and Gold Show, and they asked me to bring my stuff in and set it up. We got some gold in there. Um, so it works the same as always. Printingprospectors.com. Oh, up here. We're on America's Backyard Gold with Dave Turin. And here's a picture of us and Kevin Hoagland last year. Me and my sluice box. There's Dave Turin. Uh, you'll see us on Backyard Gold, it started. That was a lot of fun filming that, two days of filming. <laughs> and this is the pan, now that I can say it, that Dave Turn and I designed with a silicone on the front. I'll be using that this summer. I mentioned it in one video, but I couldn't really say why and how, but that, that is it. Have the stream sluice side set up over here with the grizzly bar mat for unclassified material. I did away with the flare. Now we have to have an extension that goes on the back, back there. And the back plate comes off. And we have the molds for the sluice box mats here. All set out for display. So anyway, I wanted to give you a look at that. Oh, they're doing panning over here during the day. Doing panning over here. Did a bunch yesterday, so anyway, I just thought I'd give you a first look. Um, these are now available at printingprospectors.com, and so will the pan. And <clears throat> it is middle of March, I guess, and so we'll be hitting the uh, hills real fast. Uh, stay tuned for more videos. Everyone, take care. We'll catch you next time. Bye now.